Hey everybody, it's Michelle. I am here to talk to you about another amazing, amazing paper collection. I fell in love with this from the moment I saw it. There, I know that there are a lot of designers out there that are using this collection in upcoming projects. We're going to be using this collection in a lot of projects as well. Um, this all comes from craftingonabudgetstore.com. Of course, this is from May Larson, and you know that she never disappoints, and she now has a physical storefront, um, but she does have an online store as well, so for those of us who can't get to her, we can certainly order online and have things shipped to us, and if you're going to pick Christmas papers for this year, I'm going to show you two that I'm using. Um, this is the first of them and I would say run and get this. First of all, this is by a company called Minte Papers. Um, if you've never heard of Minte, the papers are beautiful and they have this like a matte feel, but it feels so good. And the weight on the paper is, you hear it? It's amazing. Um, all of Minte papers, the very first page that um, the cover page is actually a page um, and it always has things that you can cut apart and this, look at this tree, this is so right up my alley. There is hot cocoa cups, there's little birds, there's this beautiful nutcracker, there's bows, but you know everything is better with a bow on it it is just a beautiful beautiful collection and i'm really thinking hard about what we're going to do with this collection because a lot of the papers are scenes and i hate to cut up scenes like this i mean look at that with the chandelier and the gorgeous flowers and poinsettias and stars and roses and it's all done in this creamy bur color with burgundy accents and green uh, evergreen accents it's just beautiful look at the little attention to detail with the little snow globe on the mantle you have your pinks in here it, it's just so much of what we all love. It's called Time of Wonders. I forgot to say that. I'm so very sorry. Again, I will say it is Minte Time of Wonders. And it is beautiful. Um, so we're going to really have to figure out um, how we're going to work this into our projects. Because sometimes you just want this on a page. But I don't do 12 by 12 books. Some of you do. Um, but... It's just so beautiful. The reverse side is this amazing green. Um, I don't know if it's really showing up that amazing here. It's kind of rainy out here today, but it is beautiful. Again, another scene. Look at this window scene. It says Christmas gifts. It is amazing. We have this beautiful door here that maybe we can cut out and do something with. We have this window scene. Look at this little elf on the shelf guy. Um, looking guy, I would say. Um, different coloring, of course. But he's with his little snow globe. You have a little rocking horse. Your um, nutcracker. It's very reminiscent of an, an older time period. Um but look at that. This just is amazing. The coloring, the color saturation on these pages is just to die for. Here again, we have that other scene, but this time it's opposite and a different kind of a chair with it. Just gorgeous. I mean, look at it, guys. The I'm just trying to get you to see all the details. I, I mean, I think I would like a Christmas tree like that in my own house. It's just so beautiful. And then these muted stars as the wallpaper. It, it's, it's glorious. The back of this is a script writing. I cannot read what it says at all. So I think it's, I think it's definitely 
French because I see the word Paris in there. Look at this beautiful, beautiful wreath. Just beautiful. Um, if we don't use the wreath for a single project, um, we will definitely cut out all the elements and use them for something. The reverse side of this is this pink looking damask, which I love. I'm wild about this. Wild about this collection. Look at this. I mean, this paper is just, you can see the quality of it because literally it just jumps right off the, the screen. I mean, you can tell the quality just by me holding it here in front of you. It is beautiful. And then on this one, um, we have muted swirls. I don't know if you can see the swirls too good. I'll try to bring it as close as I can. But really, really pretty. Again, Time of Wonder by Minte. I would um, get this as soon as possible. Look at the cut-aparts. The cut-apart PPs are like your ATC type cards. This is what I think I will make a mini journal with using all of these elements because I think they're just so stinking cute and I need a mini of this as well as a big journal. Um, so we're going to be doing a journal. But look at the back of these have places for photos um looks like little polaroids almost it's just it's just too much it's just too much this this collection i mean i have so many ideas for here again and then i think it repeats yes it repeats so you get two of each of the designs that i showed you um which are beautiful if you get the little pad the six by six which i would definitely encourage there is 24 double-sided sheets in here and there's four of each design um and i really like that because you know sometimes you don't want to go so big sometimes you want to use these for something else um some other type of a decorative thing i already have a couple of ideas for the for the ones that i really like that i may not want to cut apart totally so it's nice to have this mini version of it as well um, makes those type of scenes more manageable if you're doing like a eight by eight book or a six and a half by six and a half book so it does make those scenes more manageable and i do believe at the end of this does it have cut apart so i'm not sure two bonuses on the inside covers oh, okay so they have these on this inside cover and then i don't know if they have anything on... yes they do so they have these on the uh back cover and that's what i like they use every single part of their pad for paper and so you're not wasting anything. I've used Minte before and I've actually cut this strip and used it as a pocket because it has all the, the different, um, you know, up to a point. I mean, you couldn't use that part, but like up to here and made it into a pocket and it was so cute. I also got with this collection the chipboard pieces, which I'm not going to take out of the bag because once I do, I know they're going to start popping out and I, I want them in here so I can see them. But they are beautiful. They're nice weight. Um, and they're all different shapes and, and sizes. And they have, I know it's kind of hard to see with the glare, but it all is, you know, parts of the paper collection and then I love the words at the bottom you have merry and bright Christmas cheer tis the season to be jolly let's meet under the mistletoe um December magic there's all fun and frosty here comes Santa Claus so there's all cute little um words sayings that are cut apart that you can use they also have what's called chippies I didn't get those but they do have them and they're really cool too. They're wooden chipboard pieces that you can use with this collection. That would be fabulous um, to play around with. I didn't get those because um, I didn't know if I was really going to use them. Um, but look at these are the actual ephemera pieces. And I'm showing you the back of it because it's easier than taking them all out. But you have the trees 
you have your snow globe packages birds stars gingerbread nutcrackers um, poinsettias flowers bells little gingerbread houses it's just stockings it goes on and on and on and there are hmm it doesn't say how many pieces there are here let me see if it says on this that the price tag is more no it doesn't say it doesn't say how many pieces but there are a lot of pieces in here i can tell you that just by looking at it so um i love getting the ephemera pieces so that's what i got i have a lot of different things in mind for this project you guys should all know me by now there's different things that i want to do um, they will be done as tutorials. They will be done on Crafting on a Budget YouTube channel. So you better go and subscribe to that channel quickly so that you don't miss a thing. And make sure you hit the button so that you get notified every time there's a new project up. And make sure you go to craftingonabudgetstore.com to get these beautiful papers. Um, these are the ones I'll be working with. Um, so if you want to follow along with me and make the exact same project, you will definitely need these papers. And, um, like I said, this is, uh, crafting on a budget store.com. This is May Larson's store, and we're going to have so much fun with these guys. So please, please, if you can, if your budget allows, try to get some of this collection because I'm telling you, you are not going to be disappointed you are going to fall in love with it. I'm almost sorry that I didn't get two of the 12 by 12s. I, I will I will tell you that right now. Um, only because I'm a little bit of a hoarder. And I don't really think that we're going to see a collection like this again. Um, Minte comes out with beautiful collections all the time. But this one is really, really special. Again, it's called Time of Wonder, and you can find so many other pieces to it. These are just the pieces that I got, but you may see some other pieces that you have to have right along with it, um, especially those chippies. This is a paper that's made in Poland. It's very unique. It's very different, very special, and I don't know who does their artwork, but the artwork is just amazing. It, it really is just it's it's just amazing i mean just just look at that scene it is so beautiful it makes you just want to jump right into it and and live in this house and live in that um time of wonder with them so i hope you'll join me in making some beautiful christmas projects with this collection and until i see you again you know what i will say stay safe stay well and until the next time god bless you all bye for now